What's good everybody, it's your boy Uncle Sam's Reject here and welcome to today's video. You could tell by the title what we are trying to do. So basically like the part one of this video, so the first video kind of showed you guys how to actually download the team builder rosters, be able to manage the teams and get them all set up and everything like that. Now I'm going to show you guys how to import them into a road to glory. With the Tyler Hawkins story just coming out, a lot of you guys were asking how I basically, you know, uh, customize the RTG and in today's video, I'm going to show you how. All right, so first things first, here you are. You want to scroll down, go into Road to Glory. Of course, you go to Create New Player. And what you want to do now, after you hit Create New Player, you will go ahead and import your game face if you have one, or say, put one at another time. You will create your player's name, you know, likeness, what you want to look like and everything like that. And the first things first you want to do for your high school, you want to hit select either Y or Triangle, depending on if you're playing on PS3 or Xbox 360. What that would do would take you to your team builder teams that you already have downloaded. So for us, we, I'm just going to set it up basically how we had it for Tyler. We went all the way down to Garden City. That's the school we wanted him to go to. We scroll down there. We select that team. And it won't give us the actual team, but it will give us the jerseys here, right here, that we downloaded from Team Builder, the ones that we thought were the closest to what Garden City's uniforms actually look like. Now, after you have his appearance and everything set up to how you want it to look, you'll go ahead and hit Start and Create Player to begin your Road to Glory. Now, once you're in your Road to Glory, what you want to do is scroll down to Edit Season Schedule. So you'll go ahead and select however many, however many games you want to play in your season schedule, and you'll click A on each individual team. And now once you're in here to the edit opponent, you'll hit Y or triangle once again. It will bring up the rest of your team builder schools. And from there, you can go ahead and just plug and play as you see fit. So you see here we downloaded the Butler Community College squad. So this is their uniforms. Make sure everything is good, which it usually will be. And then from there, you'll be good to go. You will hit start, you know, to advance. You'll scroll down to the next school and you'll do it again. So after you go ahead and add all the teams to the list, your schedule will look like this with however many teams or however many games you put in. So the most games you probably are only going to be able to play is 11, simply because you get 12 slots. One of the teams is your team, and then you know you have to add the other 11 teams on your on your schedule. So I hope this video was informative and answered all the questions you guys had. If you have any more, hit me up in the comment section below. If you enjoyed, stop and smash that like button. It's your boy Uncle Sam's Reject, rkgames.com. I'm out of here. Peace. <laughs>